Hi everyone, welcome to Eco Learning Classes. This is Professor Geeta Mahesh. Dear students, let us discuss an important and interesting concept, price ceiling. It is important for four marks. What do you mean by price ceiling? It is a upper limit imposed by government on prices of essential goods and services. So here you can see the government imposed upper limit on the prices of goods and services is called price ceiling. Generally, price ceiling is imposed on necessary items like wheat, rice, kerosene, sugar, etc. Dear students, you can see in the diagram on x-axis quantity is measured, on y-axis price is measured. You can see here point E which we call it as equilibrium position where demand for goods is exactly equal to supply of goods and this is the market price. So here government is going to impose upper limit. So it is going to fix the maximum price should be this much because in the market the price is so high. P star or which we call it as equilibrium price is so high where the common people are unable to buy the necessary items which are very essential for life. In order to protect a poorer section of the society, government is going to fix a maximum limit should be this much. So usually price ceiling will be less than the equilibrium price. You can see equilibrium price is here, but the price ceiling you can see at PC is the price ceiling. You can see dear students, here the price ceiling will be this one which is less than the equilibrium price. It is fixed below the market determined price. See P star is market determined price where you can see here equilibrium position where demand is equal to supply. But price ceiling will be fixed below the market price. Since at that market determined price, some section of the population will not be able to afford for these type of or for essential goods. The effect of price ceiling can be understood with the help of a following diagram. Dear students, you can see in the diagram on x axis quantity is measured and on y axis prices measured. DD is the demand curve and SS is the supply curve for a product. The demand is equal to supply at point E. Q star is the equilibrium quantity and P star is equilibrium price. As goods are very essential, necessary for life, at P star, a particular level or particular uh, group of people are unable to buy necessary goods at P star. So government in order to protect that group of people, it is going to fix the price ceiling which will be less than the equilibrium price. So this is the price fixed by the government which we call it as price ceiling which we call it as price ceiling. If government is going to fix a price ceiling at PC which is lower than the equilibrium position you can observe in the diagram you can observe in the diagram dear students if price is PC what is the quantity supplied Quantity supply. Supply is Q dash C. So at price ceiling, the quantity supplied is this much. 
and you can see what is quantity demanded you can see quantity demanded is qc that means demand is greater than supply so demand is this much quantity you can see in the diagram but supply is less than the quantity demanded less than the quantity demanded so in that situation what is going to happen see demand is more supply of goods essential goods are very less because price is fixed lower than the equilibrium level so in that situation government is going to to see to overcome this equilibrium situation ration coupons are issued to the consumer to buy limited commodities at a cheaper price from the ration shops so here the price ceiling will be fixed by the government and they can buy consumers can buy from the ration shops that to limited commodities at a price which is fixed by government so in that situation you can see there will be existence of black market dear students you can see at that situation what happens there will be existence of black market you can see here there will be existence of black marketing and difficulty in obtaining goods from ration shops as the price fixed by government is lower than the equilibrium price moreover in the market you can see here supply is very less but demand is more when demand is more than the supply in the open market prices will starts increasing but they are going to supply essential goods at price ceiling through ration shops by issuing a ration coupons through ration shops by issuing ration coupons so this leads to existence of black marketing and moreover it becomes very difficult to obtain goods from ration shops so these are the two drawbacks of this price ceiling dear students let us discuss one more concept price floor which is important for four marks what do you mean by price floor means it is a lower limit imposed on prices of particular goods and services by government we call it as price floor you can see here price floor is imposition of lower limit on the prices of particular goods and services is called price floor sometimes the prices of few goods and services will fall below the particular level of price which is not good for producer of those goods and services in order to protect a producer of certain goods and services the government is going to interfere and it is going to announce a price floor which will be greater than the equilibrium price so here for certain goods and services fall in the price below a particular level is not desirable and hence government sets price floor or minimum prices for these goods and services good example for this is imposition of price floor or minimum support price program for agricultural products in order to protect farmers because the prices of agricultural items are not stable it is fluctuating to a maximum extent when there is a over production or surplus production in agricultural sector then the prices will fall and it is very essential to protect the farmers so in that situation government will interfere and it is going to fix the price which will be more than equilibrium price and which we call it as price floor the prices should not be less than the minimum price fixed by the government and even one more example to ensure minimum wage rates 
through minimum wage legislation government is going to protect laborers agricultural laborers by fixing minimum wage rates price floor is fixed always above the equilibrium price this can be explained with the help of a diagram dear students you can see here this is the equilibrium point or position and p star is the equilibrium price this is the equilibrium price and this price floor is always fixed above the equilibrium price because for few goods and services the cost of production will be more than the equilibrium price in order to protect few farmers or producers of a particular goods and services government will interfere in the market and it is going to set a price which is above the equilibrium price and at this price farmers or producers are able to recover their cost of production let us understand this concept with the help of a diagram on x axis quantity is measured on y axis price is measured demand dd is a demand curve and ss is supply curve demand curve intersects supply curve at point e which we call it as equilibrium position p star is a market determined price or equilibrium price and q star is a equilibrium quantity but at this price at equilibrium price few producers may not be able to recover their cost of production so they may lose their interest to produce such particular goods and services in order to protect these type of producers government is going to fix the price above the equilibrium price and price should not be less than this it may be a market price or any price the price should not be less than this so it is going to fix a lower price and that lower price will be more than the equilibrium price and they can sell goods and services at price floor or more than that but they cannot sell less than the price floor in the market so when that is the situation in order to prevent the price fall from falling because you can see at price floor you can see dear students in the diagram at price floor you can observe at the price floor demand is less this is the demand and you can see this will be the supply that means quantity demand is qf and quantity supply is qf1 so supply is greater than demand if this is the situation definitely we know that prices will starts falling as supply is greater than demand but as it is fixed by the government and to maintain the price at this level government need to interfere in the market and buy the surplus at a predetermined price what is the surplus the surplus quantity will be quantity supplied will be qf qf dash amount of output is excess supply in the market this much quantity is excess this much quantity is excess in the market and to maintain the price at a price floor which is fixed by government then this excess supply need to be purchased by government at a predetermined price which is the pre predetermined the price means pf is the price which we call it as predetermined or price floor dear students you can see here notes on price ceiling and price flow you can make use of this notes and get good marks 
dear students if you like please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much